Hey planners, welcome back to the channel. It's Sarah here, Creating with Sarah. Thanks so much for stopping by for another video. Today's video is a flip through of some of the press floral collection. I have two sticker books and a beautiful classic horizontal planner. So if you guys wanna check out this flip through, then keep on watching. I am so excited about this collection. This collection, um, Jungle Vibes and then Colorful Leopard and then the Strong at Heart Princess were like my top favorite collections from the new spring release of 2021. Now I have this and I also have the dashboards, the three pack dashboards that came with it. Oh, so pretty. I just love the brightness of this collection. Um, so I finally got my hands on the accessory book. This is exclusive at Joann's. And I had to go early morning to hunt for this because I knew if I went in later in the afternoon, traffic here in Cali is insane. And I just don't have the time to do a lot of um, planner shopping or hunting in the afternoon. So definitely when I go out, I have to go early in the mornings. Um, so I was able to find this and this was like in Anaheim Hills, um, north, uh, north of me. So I was so excited and I scored a 50% off coupon on this. So I'm gonna flip through this, it's so pretty. And then I got the press florals from the spring release, release day. Um, I ordered this and then I got this at Michael's. And this does start in July, but I just had to have it. It was on sale and I've been using my Michael's reward vouchers is what they call it. Um, if you download the app and every time you go buy something, make sure you scan your rewards. Um, that way you can get your vouchers. You usually get them through your email or they're in your app. Um, so typically mine are like $15 to $5 and I, I usually save them to use them on planner stuff, of course, but this, planner is gorgeous. Um, I've never had a planner with the glitter disc. This one's really pretty. I love the translucent with the glitter and I love this front cover. Um, there was a big but it's a vertical layout and I plan on getting the big um, leopard one because that's a dashboard layout and that starts in July and I would definitely like a change up because if you guys follow me I use a big, let me grab it, I use the big happy planner for my catch-all. She's getting really heavy and chunky, but I thought I would pick up the, that's the other planner I'd like to pick up. And also the Skinny Classic and the Leopard. None of my Hobby Lobbies have come out with the new stuff yet, but the reason why I got this planner is because I'm looking to, well, first, I've never used a classic in a horizontal layout, um, but I have used horizontal in my minis Happy planners, I love them. So I thought I would give it a go. And I thought either I'm gonna use this for faith, um, for writing scripture. I think it will give me more freedom to write my um, faith scriptures down or verses of the day and things like that. And um, also it may be freaking planning it with a guided journal that I have here next to me. I will flip through that in another video, but we're just gonna talk about the press floral. Um, this one here, you guys may have seen this one when it came out, I think in 2019. Um, it's super pretty. So I just thought I would franken plan this with my faith. Um, and probably do some little journaling because that's out of my comfort zone. I really wanna work on that. Um, and then of course I could always use the covers and the dividers later, but yeah, I thought we'd go ahead and flip through this first because I know you guys have seen the stickers book, stickers before, but I just thought I would flip it for fun because I started this new thing with Flip Through Fridays. So whatever I have to share, I'll share that with you guys on Fridays. Um, so look at this cover, it's so pretty. So I love this this graphic here. I love the, the realism of the flowers and then you have like these outlines, stems, it's really pretty. Okay, and then the inside has this, um, the outlines of the flowers, and then of course you have your intro to the horizontal layout here by Happy Planner. You have your um, cover page where you can write your name. This is really pretty. I like the white with the color. Okay, and then you have your two year at a glance. 
you have this section here on the sidebar where it says personal goals, financial and career. That's new or it's new to me. I haven't seen that before. That's really pretty. Oh, well, the hand lettering is really pretty. Okay, and then you get your um, year at a glance calendar. Of course, this is the 18 month. So you, um, you get that in the 18 month calendar. Then we come to July. Again, this starts in July and I'm just gonna wait because I, this planner is so pretty. I, I just, I just wanna keep it until July. I don't wanna have to like start it now. I can, I can figure it out. <laughs> okay, so this cover page or the currently page, I love the simplicity of it. So you have this grid and it says, hello, July, note to self, check it off. I really love the simplicity of that. And then here is the divider. How pretty is this? I love that. Here's your month at a glance. Seems seems fairly minimal to me. You have this pretty script cursive up here. You have this that says notes and it's in this grid box form. You do have the holidays on here, I think. Yeah, very minimal. And then it goes into the horizontal layout. And you have this little note section, which the minis are like that. And you have this little decorative spot. Nothing down the center. Just gonna flip through this. You have a quote up here up at the top. Okay, so it's yellow. And then I'm assuming it goes into pink. It's the same um, as July. Oh, I love the divider. So gorgeous. So this one actually has a wash of color down the center. Does this one have a wash of color? Yeah. Okay, only on the monthlies does it have that wash of color. The monthly view. So here's the weekly view. You have that light pink. And then the quote is up at the top. And then we get into September and it's green. Oh, you have dates. Important dates are at the bottom. I didn't notice that because it's really minimal. It's super small um, placement down there. Okay, and then here's the beautiful divider that goes into that green. Again, with the wash of color and the monthly view, and then it goes into the weekly with the green. Kind of zoomed you guys just a tad in. We'll go ahead and flip through this. And then November, or I'm sorry, October is the yellow. So does it only coordinate between, or alternate? Yes. So we, so throughout the planner, we are alternating through pink, yellow, and green. But I like that it's a little faded. The opacity is like a little um, lighter. So there's October. So I'm just gonna flip through the, since we have a feel of what the layout design is, I'm just gonna go ahead and flip through the dividers for you guys, because it's so pretty. Love that. Love the purple here for November. I love this for December. This is the cover, or this is the, um, yeah, the cover for the big, but this looks more um, red orange, and I think it's, to me, it's more pink. I could be wrong, but it looks more pink to me. Um, the planner itself, the big, planner. And again, that one's a vertical layout. There's January. Oh, February is my favorite. I love this. This is what the divider is. And I would have loved this in a big, like this cover. This green is so pretty. 
or this yellow. But I think there was a, a guided journal that had those daisies. There was like a companion pack, a guided journal. Ooh, March. That, that's pretty too. This might have been on a mini. I think there was a mini as well. April. I love the blue and the yellow and the purple. That combo is so pretty. Okay, no, this one's my favorite. <laughs> this is my month. The month of May. It's my birthday month. I like that. There's something, I don't know. I've always liked a white backdrop with color. Okay, here's June. Here's July. Here's August. I think, you know, I've never been a floral person and Happy Planner has a lot of that in their collections. Um, but I have to say this one I like. I like it because it's very simplistic. It's more like on the, I want to say boho, but more on the natural, natural side, if that makes sense. Like, I'm someone who likes that. Like, if you, you love wellness and you love, um, like, organic things or more natural things uh, in that sense, then you will love this. This is why I like this. It's very peaceful, very calming, very... Um, simplistic it's not like and it's more realistic it's not like um what am i trying to say like some of the graphics that could be over the top for me in florals i don't know if that makes any sense but i just really like this collection here's november and here's december like this is very pretty the whole press thing is pretty okay so here's the back it says plan a happy life there is that new in the happy planners yeah because it didn't say they used to say live creatively was that the back side okay here's the back side i really like this planner i'm so glad i picked it up that way can have it in my collection. It's just so gorgeous. Okay, so enough with the planner. I got the planner. Of course, I got the dashboards. These are really great. I love collecting the accessories. And then let's get into the sticker books. You in just a little bit more. So actually, I want to flip through the accessory book first. Just as oh, there's my receipt. Actually, I was looking for this. <laughs> I want to flip through this with you guys together because I haven't really done that yet. And I think that's what that will give me a chance to actually look through my sticker books um, with you guys. So that's why I like doing these flip through Fridays. Okay. I love this in the background. That's cool. Okay. So I love these. And they used to have like um, accessory packs. Do I even have one over here? I wish they would do these again. And maybe do this. I don't really use these a whole lot, the inspo cards, but um, I love the sticky notes and then the extra stickers because was it just me or did anybody notice that they didn't come out with like tiny sticker pads? I really like the tiny sticker pads too. I mean, we all love stickers. Um, I wish they would bring these back, but maybe change this at the bottom. But anyhow, accessory book. I love the list pad. I love the sticky notes because um, having these, it's like limited edition because I don't know, you can't get this anywhere else, like these sticky notes and stuff. Okay, so we have some cute boxes and the press florals and their paper. We have monthly boxes, little headers, little deco stickers in there right here. Oh, I love the color. It just reminds me of spring and Easter. I love the speckle on there. So you get two pages of those. You have these sidebars and all these pretty press florals and it's all paper stickers. Then you get these headers and the um, checklist stickers. Get two pages of those. 
Would have been nice if this was your decorative and then you get the same sheet but without the the um, little foliage. Is that the word? I think that's the word. <laughs> and then these are different. So they're like side tab stickers with little bullets. That's cool. Kind of looks like a mini divider sticker or something. So you get two pages of those, one with foil and one without. Then we have these boxes are really cute. I actually like the decorative stickers on them. Kind of gives you like the gardening sticker books that came out, which I loved. I love having the butterflies in there, but I don't really garden. Um, but I noticed that the color tones were a little bit darker. These are a little bit lighter. I don't know. I just really like this color palette. This collection is so beautiful. Two pages of those. Then we get like giant clear stickers. Is this two pages or one? That's one. Okay. Then these are gorgeous. These are long stemmed flowers clear and colorful. Then we have a smaller ones. Ooh, these are different. So these are like uh, corner stickers that you can put in your monthly view. Um, you could probably put them in your vertical layout at the tops or in the corners just to tag something important um, or something that is currently all the time. I love that. Oh, wow, these are beautiful. I love the press look. Wow, those actually look real. <laughs> love that. And then you get, a, these are paper. Then you get the cute deco, pretty press floral, smaller version, uh, larger version, and that's it. Totally love this sticker book, so pretty, okay. Then, lastly, we have the classic size. Super pretty. So it's a kind of the same. You just get more um, decorative, lots of boxes, clear. We have a page of, um, I guess, phrases. <laughs> Can't think of the word. Okay, so we have some boxes with gold foiling. We have some with grid, some with line and a bullet. We have some side stickers here. Monthly boxes. And then we have these. I've seen these before, I just don't remember off the top of my head. I think they came out like in the seasonal, like in the fall one. They had some like this with that color strip and then the header. Ah. I like that they have to do. Yay, we get a full sheet of that. Appointments, grocery list, meeting. I love that. Got some great functional daily ones that you use. Then we have these washi strip stickers. These are great for layering. Some more clear flowers. These are with gold instead of white. That's pretty. And then we have more of this green metallic foil. I like this. I know a lot of people don't, but I like it. That's really pretty. Some more flower stickers, some larger ones. These are all paper. Another, another sheet of this because you have those in here too. Then we have these. And no foiling on those. They're just like this light coral color. We have these gold ones, which were in here. But these are gold. This is my favorite. I love this foiling. And Happy Planner does this, and they, they have done a, a blue one too. Oh, these are nice. That's really pretty. Paper. Now these are nice. These are pretty. These would be great for fall. 
I would definitely use these also for a Christmas spread because you got some berries in there. Very pretty. Definitely gives me vintage vibes. These pressed flowers look so real. Oh my gosh. You get two pages of those, which were in here as well. These are new. Really pretty. Wow, they look so real. So you get um, a larger size and you get the smaller ones. Then you get into your boxes, which I love how they did this. So you have pink shades, coral or orangey shades, yellow, love that, purple, Have like the rainbow green definitely make a rainbow spread with this blue ah that blue is so gorgeous and then you get all the colors but you get like sidebars and you get the like these tab stickers cute these would be cute for spring cleaning a little bucket list or something or probably these you have these giant clear stickers. Believe you can, choose happy, embrace your pace, chase the sunset, and sunrise. Those are pretty. Just Bloom. I've seen a lot of the squad use these in their spreads. Really pretty. Choose Joy. And this one, the whole entire time I thought people were using the Mambi sticks spelling this out because everyone's been doing that trend oh uh, and it was in this sticker book again i haven't had the chance to look through these i definitely wanted to share them with you a flip through um yeah because i don't get them when everyone else does so that's so funny but it's it's, a, it's really pretty and people's in, uh in the squads planners they do such a great job okay and lastly you have this page all in gold. My only thing with this is that sometimes it's hard to see that. Like I wish they would leave that in white with like a faint, with a light black outline or just white. But they're just, they're a bunch of quotes, like quick um, happy planner related quotes. Cool. Beautiful collection. I am so happy with this. Um, again, I think there was more to this, but these were like my top favorites and I just wanted to share this flip through with you guys because I plan on definitely using more of the spring release in April. I'm so excited, I can't wait. But I hope you guys enjoyed this little um, Friday flip through with me on some of my favorite things from the Happy Planner spring release. And if you did, definitely give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. Take care, stay safe, and happy planning. Bye.